As Switzerland marks its birthday, the nation basks in the richness of its history. Shaped by remarkable events and endearing attributes, Nestled amidst the breathtaking Alps, Switzerland has earned its reputation for natural beauty and neutrality. Christina is a senior who has lived both in Switzerland and across the border. However, she chose to turn back and remain here. Let's see what she has to say. Oh, there are so many things about uh, my country. I love my country. What I like most is the stability, the freedom of speech also the stability, which is very calming. Sometimes some people find it's boring. For me it was not boring, it was very calming coming back from times where it was, everything was a bit upside down. I love the traditions in Switzerland, I love the family life and the direct democracy. Switzerland's flag, a symbol of national pride and unity, features a striking design of a red field adorned with a bold white cross at its centre. The simplicity of its composition embodies Switzerland's cherished values. Strength, neutrality and solidarity. Stefan is a Swiss who works as an operations manager, but once a year he shows his hidden talent as a flag twirler. Das ist für mich natürlich Heimat. Äh, ich bin hier geboren und äh, ist für mich natürlich das Schönste, was ich machen kann. Als Hobby natürlich auch äh, die Schweizer Fahne zu zeigen, also in die ganze Welt rauszutragen. Und ja, das ist definitiv sehr, sehr cool. Das ist definitiv. Äh, ich fühle mich in der Schweiz definitiv sicher. Ich bin ein Bodenständiger. Ich habe hier in der Schweiz nicht nur die sehr schönen Seen sondern auch Berge. Ich kann zwei Stunden fahren und bin in einer anderen Gegend, äh, andere Sprachen. Und ja, wo gibt es das schon in welchem Land? Und ja, so ein schöner Fleck auf Erden ist, ist mir wirklich stolz, dass wir hier da, äh, aufwachsen und daheim sind. Another tradition that the Swiss do is to make bonfires. As flames flickered and danced, they symbolized the spirit of independence and solidarity among the diverse cantons. Today, they not only commemorate the nation's birth, but also foster a sense of pride, patriotism and belonging among the Swiss people. One of these people is Sophia, a Swiss woman who lives in Mexico. This is a performer ballerina and a fire dancer. I like a lot uh, the nature. Always when I come back, uh, go to the rivers or see how everything is so clean in the lakes. Uh, and um, yeah, have uh, most of all, I think, the water. Not in every city of, not, I think, in any city of South America, you can find a place where you can have uh, free water and the rivers. So there are a lot of rivers and super beautiful, but rivers that go in the cities, that flows in the cities and you can just have a bath after work. I think that's very special. Evelet is a student. Now she is on vacation and went with her parents to Italy. But she didn't forget that today is Switzerland's day. Evelet sent us some thoughts. What I just realized when I come back to Switzerland, what I really appreciate is the beauty of the sauberness. It is a good example for me. Man sieht auf jeder Straße überall ein bisschen Müll liegen. Das schätze ich sehr an der Schweiz, dass es das fast jeder macht. Und dann ist auch noch die Sicherheit. Ich reite auch. Das heißt, ich fühle mich sehr verbunden mit den Landschaften. Das schätze ich an der Schweiz sehr. On this special day, let us salute the past, embrace the present and pave the way for a harmonious and prosperous future. Happy birthday, Switzerland. May your journey continue to inspire the world.